Welcome everybody to the Hate View Tottenham 4, Aston Villa 1. Bruv, Emery, bruv, is, is, this guy's missing. Is, this guy is nowhere to be seen today. Tottenham bossed the game and cooked the game. Villa's just, just poor today. I mean, this is the worst Villa performance I've seen this season. 4-1 to Spurs. I'm, you're winning half time and you just fell apart. The whole team fell apart. The whole team, the whole system of entering like Emery today. Just fell apart. I'm, 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 I'm just trying to understand at what point. I mean, they did it against West Ham. They were winning one nil. Then they just scored, and then you know we just got battered today. Spurs is just a one of a kind team. Sadly, they beaten Villa today. Um, Bantam Club should have got a red. Because of the challenges he made today, three challenges. I don't get why he didn't get, but at least get, we got a, only a yellow card, two warnings and a yellow card. But yes, yeah, Spurs bossed it and cooked Villa and cooked them real good. The tactic worked for Ange. Ange just made sure that, okay, we need to, to press hard on them. Johnson, press hard on them. Dejan, press hard on them. Dominic Slanky, press hard on them. First goal to um, d- d- um Johnson, I'm sorry, it was from Villa. It was from Morgan Rogers. Good cross. But again, we need to see more of Villa from that. We need to see more of Villa to attack. Because Villa's just well disappointed. Just the fans of the, the villains just just felt heartbroken to see how they went from a good goal from Rogers to have ripped apart, teared apart. And yeah, um, the only thing I'm happy about this game, the the only thing I can say that I'm happy was that Johnson scored a goal. I can honest that's the only time I can say, wow, that was only the big thing that happened today. Johnson scored, Spurs looking for a, come, a comeback, um, which they did. Spurs, Dominic Sankey, Andre Striker, don't get enough credit for what he's done for Tottenham and Bournemouth. 16 goals last season. And he is a perfect candidate to replace Harry Kane for Tottenham. And they just scored two goals. And, you know, and that's the thing I like. What I like about Solanke is that Dejan Kulisevsky found the right pass for Solanke to go through. Solanke said, nope, I'm, I'm not going to go on the left. I'm going to go on the right a bit more. Found the right pass. 2 3 1. And then I, and the rest of the time, it was just Spurs. Bossing the game, Emery being like cooked. But there is a masterclass from Ant Postecoglou coming. He just said he wants to win trophies for Tottenham, and who knows? He might win a trophy. They do have Manchester United next, but they do have Galatasaray next. Man, Man-, Man-, Man- United in the Carabao Cup. Then they've got. Um, Ips, they've got Ipswich, they've got Gatas, right? Ipswich, but the dear Manchester United in their fake, they're not FA Cup to Carabao Cup. Villa, man, this is not looking good for Emery today. Emery, where was Emery? Where was Emery's tactics? The defense of Villa just, just reeked of garbage today, was just one of, one of the game where. Spurs can break down your defence and you can't let Spurs break down your defence like that. But yeah, Spurs just won 4-1, just not really 
as far as when Spurs win some really boring game, it's not really like a game that would be like, whoa, excited. It's more exciting when they lose a game, but when they win a game, it's like, boring, 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 boring Tottenham Hotspur. Um, Spurs do have Ipswich Town under Sunday kick on Sunday because of the uh, attached by a match on Thursday. Villa got Liverpool on Saturday eight pm, which will be on neutral perspective. Villa versus New um the Liverpool match on Anfield eight pm. But it, it's just today that they they just fell apart. You know they just didn't give it a best, and this is something that I'm I'm thinking about Villa. If they can't handle Tottenham side that like Johnson, Solanke, Dejan, how are they going to handle teams like Barca, Real Madrid? Yes, they're first in the champ. Champions League because they have not conceded a goal against Bologna. They have not conceded a goal against um. They have not conceded a goal against Bayern and Young Boys. But like, I just feel like if you can't control your team against Spurs at Shite Heart Lane, how are you going to control your team at the? Um, today's next game. How are you going to control against um Champions League? And Champions League is a different level. <sighs> Spurs, Spurs is just a BS team to watch right now. Bush, um, I, I hate. Doing this, I, I I hate watching Spurs, man. I actually thought it was gonna be a free two Durant goal last minute, but <clears throat> bruv, they just dominated, found the right space, and like they found the right players to cop fight to make them win the game. Ten minutes ago, Madison scores. Um, yeah. Madison had to score that goal, but well done to um, Tottenham for winning the match. Um, really disappointing for Villa. Just fell apart, capitulated, just didn't give the right reason to come alive and didn't really want to win the game. They just felt, you know what, not winning the game is easy. And in Emory, going to the away dressing room after full time, 10 minutes to go. They could have scored two goals, at least two goals in 10 minutes. But Spurs just said no. So unfortunately, Spurs won. Um... <sighs> Um, they did play the better team. Tough team to play against Aston Villa, but Spurs managed to get the victory against Aston Villa. But they did, Spurs did boss the game first half. First half, it was just Spurs finding the right players. Spurs finding the right pass, Spurs going to the game, getting something because they did. Yes, they did beat Man City in the Carabao Cup, but then that is just motivation for them. That is just brings the motivation to your team. To beat a team like Man City gives you more confidence. And so, congratulations to Tottenham for beating Villa 4 1. So. Yeah, Spurs one four one. There's nothing else to be happy about when you're living it's your biggest rivals win.
Um, thanks guys for watching this video. Hit the subscribe button if you're new. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. The next video is Manchester United versus Chelsea today. Plus, the new um, Champions League games will be the Liverpool versus um, Bayern Leverkusen. Then we've got the new perspective. We have got the uh, Real Madrid versus AC Milan. And Wednesday, we have got the uh, Inter Milan versus Arsenal. And then we've got PS3 versus Bayern Munich. Four, two, four games next week. Plus, we've got West Ham Everton. Plus, we've got Brighton Man City. Plus, we've got the Aston Villa Liverpool. So, and Sunday, big game West Side versus North Side. Stamford Bridge, Arsenal versus Chelsea at the Stamford Bridge. Eight games to do with these, plus the, oh, sorry, nine games, including the game week predictions. Peace, I'm out. Come on, you Iron Spurs one. Yay.